When the pandemic hit last year, so many dreams were shattered. I mean, existing businesses struggled and businesses that are starting up, so they staggered. Yeah, local artist used his downtime to make more art. And now he's back on his feet again with help from bands. It's a way to create the art through painting, that you can take the paintings and put them to the garment so you can hang the art, wear the art, and become the art. If you hadn't noticed from a quick peek around Brian Robinson's studio, he's all about creating. I was that student in the back of the classroom that was always drawing. Doodling. Doodling. <laughs> and the teacher thought I was doing biology, chemistry, whatever. I was creating these, these weird characters called boneheads. What can you tell me about this? Okay, picture? so that's, that's called nurture. It's called nurture. And you look at it, it looks like a mother or a sister. When I was younger, I loved eating cereal, especially my sister's cereal. So this right here is actually showing you a mother or a sister that has to determine which child should get this cereal. Of course, From his bonehead sister. illustrations created as a teenager to his animations and clothing line, this self-taught artist has created a brand called the Black Genius Art Show. As a child, I, I remember like I wanted a dog, so I would just start drawing pictures of dogs. So I wanted my art to reflect the things I wanted in life. So I never got the dog, by the way, though. By day, he teaches pre-K in Pigtown. So I like to ignite conversations with kids and really see where their mind is. Before COVID, you'd see this community artist all over town at festivals like Afram and Artscape selling his work. He was expanding. Just before the pandemic, he'd moved into his own space. Once COVID hit, it was like that whole community aspect that I thought I could bring into the brick and mortar, it ceased. It was like, oh, restrictions, oh, people can't come in. So when that happened, I was left to come into this empty building and just create. If you don't have the small business, you won't have the big business. If you don't have the small business, you won't have that good ground level market that we all need. Now he's creating shoes. Robinson was selected by Vans for their foot the bill campaign. In an effort to help struggling businesses, the sneaker company picked entrepreneurs to design a shoe and sell it on the Vans website. I'm able to design my artwork onto up to a thousand pair of shoes and it goes nationwide. He gets to keep all the proceeds and that's making his future a lot brighter and his canvas a lot more colorful. I think I am living my dream, I, I really am. I like to wake up in, in this, yeah, that's my motto, it's create every day and I, I feel like every day I wake up, I'm like, it's natural to me, you know, so I'm living in, in what I love doing, creating art. And if you'd like to support the Black Genius Art Show, check out his shoes on the Vans website, Foot the Bill campaign. Remember, only a thousand pair. You can also find a link to his art on our website, and that'll be attached to this story, wmr2news.com.